What's up guys, it's your favorite crappy artist here, and today we're going to be doing another unoriginal video, because I crave attention. Today we're going to be doing a Ross Draws tutorial. I'm going to, or at least try, because as I said before, <laughs> I'm not very good. But if you do like my art in my videos, just make sure to hit the subscribe button down below and leave a like or comment. Okay, let's get into this crappy drawing. Stylized portrait tutorial. Ooh. Yeah, so this is the vibe I'm going for. You know, this is a simple sketch that I had prepared for this episode. So today I decided to draw my D&D character. Uh, her name is Arya and she's a rogue and she's a tiefling. Um, as you can see on the side right here, I have the outline. Uh, so I basically have like all the layers in here. Um, yeah, and then up here is just like copies that I do of the layers, just in case, you know, I really don't want to mess up. So, I have these colors picked out for me, and what I like to do with these stylized portraits is have a nice combination of warm colors and cool colors. So, one of the things that Ross does mention is the colors, and he picked his color scheme. So, my color schemes are right here. He did mention a, um, a cooler and a warmer, you know, kind of combine it, so that's kind of did that so the warmer color for me is going to be her outfit and then the um her skin and her hair is going to be kind of like a cooler color um and her eyes i'm still debating about what color i'm going to do eyes but yeah so another thing that i did notice is that he does have his layers on multiply so i should probably it's a lot of it's a lot of layers it's a lot of there's a lot of layers to copy. Okay, so I managed to find a short. Oh, wait. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. So I managed to do a shortcut that I wanted to use. So this is going to be my backup layers in case I pick anything up because, you know, I tend to do that because I am a fuck up. Um, I do. I guess I'll start coloring the skin. So you literally just has two colors so I guess I'm just gonna use these two and then are these the same color no this one's lighter than that one okay so the skin um he did use a soft brush so I'm just gonna use maybe because this is the one I usually do all right let's uh let's get started Dad of YouTube has abandoned. Oh, I didn't erase that eye. No, wait, no, it is the face. Do I have a copy of the face? Uh, uh, now I'm stressed. Sometimes I use an airbrush just to quickly. Ooh, that's cool. So, he is talking about using an airbrush. Wait, is he using the same layer? Holy <coughs> he is using the same- oh, what a champ. Buddy Buzz, he said he used a airbrush. What is happening to this picture? Who am I? Okay, you know what's always good? Blending. Bitch, <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? Oh, you know what I said, did? I made another copy. He looks so bad. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna start a little bit. Okay, that doesn't look, that doesn't look bad. <laughs> I'm gonna do the hair on top, 
just because I feel like it might be a little easier to handle and I can just cover up all the blotches that, I, you know, I don't have to worry about those. pretty nice kind of not really okay moving on going to uh, put in some of the light I love adding this part I tried to light it not the highlights but the light and I already added lights um, I'm not sure if you can tell but I'm gonna do the same thing to her hair. So I kind of just like brought it down a little because I didn't like how it looked like fully. I mean it kind of looks fine now but uh, it's kind of like all over the place to be honest but whatever. It's Rostra's. pretty bad but you know it's okay it is okay not really but it's okay I try to turn the form I take the background color and apply it on the side of the cheeks okay so basically he's saying to have a background I mean he doesn't necessarily have a background color yet um I mean I guess That looks so bad. <laughs> oh my god, this drawing is looking so bad. Oh Jesus Christ. This sucks. Well, if maybe we add like a like a dragon. Something that matches the character essence, like a tail here. Well, this dude wants companions. And um luckily my char oh my character actually does have a companion. She has to have two. Um we have squeakers and cheese. So I kind of just did these two right here, um, the two little mice, and I guess it's time to color them, huh? How am I gonna do a painting without color dodge? So, let's do some color dodge. So, now that everything else is done, it's the final touches, the fun part. A color dodge! It doesn't have color dodge on paint tool size, so I switched to Photoshop because I know this one does. Whoa, that's so intense. Oh, so, wow! This is fun! So I am going to do a little bit of changes to the mouth because I'm not necessarily feeling it too much. Okay, after a few adjustments, here is the uh, final image. <laughs> ah, look at the top of his head! Color dodge is what really brought the whole thing together. But I mean, um, yeah, that's it. There's my crappy drawing, everybody. If you like this video, make sure that you give the thumbs up. If you want to see more of my videos, make sure you hit the subscribe button. And leave a comment below, and leave a comment down below telling me how I did. All right, I think that's about it. Thank you so much for watching, and see you later.